come off. You get off, Heather. gone up to 30.5 degrees now. It's getting worse. As soon as we leave the mountains, the higher area, the temperature really climbs, doesn't it? Here we are in Harrow in the Martinez Bodega for a tour. Beautiful day. As always, 26 degrees. A relief to get off the bike after two hours. Let's see how it goes. <laughs> how was it? Yeah, and they did all that. Yeah, yeah. They had like three laps like this. Cool. So this is special wine. Yes, it's here for special wine. And here the product is Balkans. And there is Balkans.
Look how dry it all looks now. It's all brown, isn't it? Not had a lot of rain here. Oh, with the with the breeze that's mm. that's come along. Yeah, it is getting a bit breezy. A bit breezy. It's breezy. I don't mind that. After all this heat. Oh no. English menu. English menu, please. Salad. Kids will never believe it, you see. <laughs> a small salad, pate, what have you? Oh, you have got mine, yeah. Oh, nice. <laughs> Media connected. Have you got my gloves? Goodbye to the parador. Parador, Hello? Hello? Hey, you can hear me. Yeah, Wendy can't hear me. Has she got it switched on? Switched on. Yeah, it's flashing blue. Is yours, is yours and mine green then, Steve? Yeah, yeah I can hear you fine. Wendy's just in blue. Yeah. Yours isn't flashing at all. Oh, it is green. Group Indicom. This thing's come up for command. One coffee stop later. A tiny village in the back of beyond. Sorry? It is, yeah. One, one and a half miles, turn left. What this, what this is telling me, what it's telling me is, uh, what? It's saying to turn around. Oh, I heard turn left and stop sign. Yeah, it says turn left, but the actual diagram is... So it's showing you go right around and go back. Go oh, back. Okay, sorry. Oh, no, Jack or Steve. Jack, yeah, I'm oh, sorry, it should be left. This way? This way. Left. Oh, now we're not even on a route. Now we're not even on a route, are we? Now it's trying to turn us right and to, and to go back. So forget that. Oh, I'm completely lost. It says now... Yeah, and it you turn and it says we won't get there till 20 past 4. She's saying turn turn around. We're going the wrong way. Oh, 
the thing with the Insta as well is that you can't see whether you're on still photographs or time lapse or video. You can't yeah. see it. At least on the, I think when the Insta bring out their remote, which is two weeks time, it tells you everything on the remote. So you can't operate it without it. Not on a bike. Oh, should we turn left here? No, no. Uh, towards Jacko, where did you say? Straight on, straight on, straight on yeah. yeah. Up loaded to the left. Sorry, left. What have we got to stop for? They seem to do that. I, know, I noticed the other day when we had that police car in front of us. Yeah. Well, it is a stop sign. He stopped and a lady stopped like on the other side of the road. Well, why can't he go now? She pulled. And There's a car pulled. now. Yeah, no, he, that's right. So I assumed it was a bit like the state. They come to the stop sign and they have to stop. Oh, yeah, but he stopped. He yeah. went past the stop sign. Yeah. I thought the watch I can't wait. Menu. Yeah. Menu with a... Ah! Yeah! Oh, the Tour de France must be just... That's what we'll do tomorrow, go and see the tour. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. <laughs> wow, this is this is pretty spectacular. Yeah, this is where they must canoe and. Beautiful. It's, it's such an alpine type village, isn't it? Very nice. Just climbing and climbing, isn't that? Once we get out of here, higher and higher. the pool. No, you don't.
Yeah, I've got the I've got the card. But if I had to get back, you know, yeah. that's where you need the insurance. Like It is, isn't it? Look at that. Yeah, 30 degrees. Nice, nice and cool, yeah. <laughs> you hope it was water. Quite spectacular. Wherever, wherever you look, it's just brilliant. Yeah. Are they? Interesting. We talk about Yeah, they have. Yeah. It's when it eats the monitor of the glen. <laughs> That's when they have a problem. Yeah, we're like halfway up the mountain already. No, we're not halfway up, we're about a tenth of the way up, I think. I don't know how the bikes come up here. No. It's killing walking up. I know on the, um, the geology route, they have loads of quite 
That is spectacular, that one, isn't it? Do they? So they're inedible. Uh, yeah, you see them every, and they they actually go rotten on the trees. Yeah. And, but wild strawberries, it's amazing. Yeah. Well, you know that. Yeah. Hello. Breathtaking, isn't it? Too. I can't get far enough back to get a good picture. <laughs> you could go in there now, you could see it. It's quite a good one, it's a good one. It's a good one. Over there, you see how wet it is. Like, see that outcrop of rock? Yeah. You can see like little trickles on either Oh, coming side. down, that's right. Yeah. Look how okay, this pool just goes through very gently and underneath the waterfall. Yeah. Oh, that's so lovely. You could just lie in that there yeah. on his feet. Oh, the temperature, it's got to be 30 degrees now. So, Cheerio Parador Beliza. Yeah, uh, no, from Parador Beliza. From, from Parador Beliza. About five hours. Santa no, Domingo. It, it came up even quicker on Google Maps morning, Saturday morning, I think. Four hours, 18. Well, mine says we'll get at 3.22, and it's that's exactly five hours, so it's because I've had to recalculate immediately. Oh, unless I unless I cancel, Steve, let me cancel it and and put it in again. Trip planner, Belize to Santa Mago. Four hours forty. Start. Start. Calculating route. Go. Now it says we get there at eight minutes past three, which is four and a half hours, something like that. Yeah. So, are you ready? Yeah. Oh, it's lovely and cool as soon as you start to ride. Yeah. Signposting chippings again. Yeah. Oh, it's those little patches, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's come up off route. Recalculate. Oh, mine's, oh yeah, mine's just calculated to seven minutes. Then we'd be off route. How can we be off route? You started. I think I'll say no. Yeah, mine's not, I, I've set mine as, I didn't set mine to ask me, so it's... Ah. Just kept recalculating. Mine's almost done now. Oh, now it says it'll get there at 20 past five, uh, 20 yeah. to, 20 to six tonight. <laughs> oh, loving it. We'll find the, we'll find the petrol station 
and have a look. I'll have to switch it off again, but why it's saying off route when we just started the route? And there's no other route here. There's no other route on it. I expect half the garments in the world are thrown in the sea. Yeah. It can't even start with it going without it going wrong. Yes. <laughs> it's just head west towards Pamplona. Yeah. yeah with it, to be honest, it, it's probably from Pamplona we turn down to Lagrono, and it's just that last bit where he really didn't stand up. I know, it's just, you'd like, you'd like to know that you can make it work. Yeah. Every single time we start, it decides to go on its own. It's doubled the journey time now. <laughs> So I've got to stop it and um, so I hit stop, go back and trip planner, go from Parador Belisa, only one road. Yeah. Please drive to highlighted route, off route, recalculate. Oh, in, in my earphone it said you're now off route, recalculate. It, so I can't even start it. Yes or no to recalculate. If I say no, no, if I say yes it adds half an hour to it. If I say no it adds five hours to it. It's a lovely morning, it's already 20, 22 and a half degrees. Yeah. It's surprising how high we are actually, isn't it? Look how far down it is into the valley. Uh, how much higher again we were, yeah? Um, uh, yeah, and, and we've been dropping for 10 minutes now. Yeah. And it's still a long way down into the... Um, the hairpins. There's a hairpins here, yeah. I can't, I can't see my map because of this big sign saying recalculate. Yeah. I might as well say no again just to get rid of it. Yeah, I can see the map now. Yeah, we've got the sharp hairpin at the end of this bit. Yeah. Sun's coming out again. Yeah. Sometimes hanging around the valley. Twen often they do get moisture overnight and then Yeah. It steams off, you get a cloud for about an hour and then it then it burns away. off, yeah. Yeah, it's gone up to twenty-three now. Very pleasant. Yes, Wednesday when when we ride back. Yeah. What is it, Heather in Devon? Thirty degrees <laughs> at our place on Wednesday, and then thunderstorm. So we get back just in time. Yeah. The sat nav takes you. Wow, the sat nav doesn't. Oh, I don't know what the sat nav's doing. I don't care. Oh yeah. It doesn't take you this oh, way. No, I think it takes you through the town and out the other side. Oh, that would be Different. terrible. As we came up, there was a sign for Bielsa on the left. That's weird, that. Yeah. Yeah, there was a sign. It's taking you through the town. Just what you, w you wouldn't want. Off route. Oh. Off route again. The flattest country in Europe is trying to get you around the mountains. 
<laughs> they might be coming up for the Tour de France. No, this would be a strange way to come, wouldn't it? It would be. So the Dutch like going to the mountains. Yeah. Yeah, it's quite pleasant. It has gone up to 24 and a half degrees yeah. in that last mile or two. Cool, how can he see? Oh, I see. Which you can understand totally. Yeah. Yeah, Google will know whether there's traffic jams and all sorts of things. Yeah. But this is, uh, this is something else. It just makes you not trust the Garmin at all. No. It shouldn't do that. Two hours I know. There are. Well, I'm just going to leave it alone now because yeah. although I've said no don't recalculate it stayed at 10 past 4 with a, a very greyed out magenta route so I'm still on it but it's not it, it's not giving me any instructions yeah, I wonder if it is sending it back to the power door yeah because it's adding a minute all the time the further we get away it's adding time oh yeah mine says 4.11 now yeah exactly oh uh, that's what it That's right. But that's bizarre, isn't it? Because you can't... It just gives you a choice of start or finish. It doesn't say, do you want to carry on? Is it? Oh, it might come back. Yeah, mine, mine's 4.12. Is it? Does it? Wow. Um, I haven't looked at mine yet. Let me get round this bend. A 418 I've got. But it's not telling me to U-turn. Yeah, because I've gone up to 4.26 now. So it, it, it's exactly what you st say, Steve. It's allowed. Yeah. The further from the Parador, at this rate, it'll be saying we'll get there at midnight. Yeah. The f we're, we're pulling away. Further Well, we're, we're going at whatever we're going at, 50 mile an hour or something. We're pulling away from it. Can I stop it? Like, hey, get, get your hand ready, other. Put your hand out. Did you? Yeah. Oh, very good. No. Oh, that's so stupid, isn't it? T-shirt. He had shorts on, didn't he? He could have died. Yeah, I didn't. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot how windy this road is. Yeah. It's okay. Yeah. That's right.
I haven't done anything. I oh, know it's a short one, this. I was thinking it was a long one. The motorhome. Now, now attention tunnel. Hand, hand out of that. Missed it. Just flash in here. Yeah. Ah. Ah, oh, I see. I'll stay in this lane because we got the motor home. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 50 mile an hour. Bicycles or something. Oh, I'll go. I'm not going to catch up with the... Uh... Uh, no, that's right. We, we, we could, yeah. Let's see if there's parking near a nice cafe. Might it might be, yeah. Uh... Oh, we stay on the A12 the whole way. Yeah, so, on the A12 down to Lagrono, takes us through Lagrono. Down the outside of Lagrono. Mm. Well, actually, it looks like that actually takes us right through. But, it's but we should see signposts, which then take us through to Nigeria. And then next stop is San Domingo de la Charles de Day. I'm going to try and put that in there. Could do. Another amazing bridge. How does it stay up just on one, one uh, beam? Yeah. I know. It says radar, but I don't know what the speed was. 80. Oh yeah, 62. Look at that black building over there to the right. Okay then, you're ready to go. Here we are at the at the Parador in San Domenico. Hostel for pilgrims to stay the night on the way to Santiago. Much better to see how we get out now, isn't it? Yeah, he's got totally wrong there. So you go out that way. Do you think? Um, 
do you think out there there's down that end, bollards at the no, end? It's got no entry sign at that end for coming in. Ah. But yesterday that car came in here. So we can go straight out that way. But how can you have a glass of wine for a euro, 80p? Oh, re red wine is only a pound. Yeah, I was just saying, it's only, only 150, isn't it? Very nice to this cafe just been open seven days today. Pilgrims who've walked from Denmark through to Santiago and decided to come back here and open a cafe. Amazing. Wine at one euro a glass. This is a perfect weather, 24 degrees. If it would stay like this all day. Well, as I say, it's supposed to be a high of 25 this time out there. Well, that, that could be good. Which means if we're going north, it should stay cooler. It should stay cooler. Yeah. These roads are so smooth, they're almost like brand new, aren't they? Beautiful. Some flowers as far as you can see. They look quite funny because they all face the same way. They all face the same way. There they are. I know. <laughs> If we run out of petrol now, we can quickly shoot up and bang them in the back. <laughs> I haven't seen any more. Oh no, it is. Oh no, is up here. That's our only chance for petrol, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, two kilometres, so it must be just there. Just about a mile. The police are probably just like us, they can, I haven't got enough petrol to get to Rona. <laughs> Four RTs all in a row. Yeah. It's a 62 limit here and we're all doing 47. Yeah, but it's, this would be a failure on your uh, I, IAM going so slow and not on a fast road. But well, when even, I, even in your driving test, that car would probably fail. Yeah, be failed, yeah. We got petrol, so we don't need there's to worry. A, there's a big black bird up there. Huh? Yeah. Vulture? No, to the left. It's not like one we've seen before. Could be a vulture then. I haven't seen any like that so far. That's a crazy black thing. Completely black. No other half. Oh. Ah. Not quite your head. Not that I can see, they look totally black. It's like a brand new surface almost, isn't it? Yeah. Very grippy.
sure. There's some twisty bends on here by looking at this sat nav. Big one here, not here, next one. Oh yeah, well, back road south. This one. Yeah. I'm gonna go into first this time. Yeah. I think. Yeah I will. Just have that bit more control for turning. Yeah, yeah it's easy man. And again now actually. Yeah. So then, is that a petrol station in front of us? <laughs> well, that was a nice lunch anyway. Yeah. We can relax. Um, perfect timing. Yeah, it is good. Well, that was good. For twelve fifty each, including yeah. three courses. Yeah, three courses and. Um, I, I think we could have had the coffee. I think we could have had the coffee. Yeah. Uh, uh, and yeah. even though we had water, we could have had wine. Yeah. So that was fantastic. Twelve fifty. Such a lovely road because there's so little on it. And just bend after bend after bend. Yeah. You think loads of people will be on this road going to Santander Ferry now? Yeah, the car drivers probably would hate this road. So they leave it all for bikers. Yeah, I know. <laughs>
this is a sharp bend. This looks a nice little restaurant. I oh, know it's not somebody's house. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, that's a nice house. It is very Swiss, yeah. Another one for sale. Half of Spain is for sale. Look at that one with tunnels. Oh, beautiful. All right, so it's 35 it says on that sign it's not it's 31 oh, I've got 29.5 have you I've gone no no I haven't got 31 I'm looking at the speed limit <laughs> oh dear no I've got 29 yeah you always half yeah, half a degree and this that's the first petrol for what 50 miles yeah wow Inside the road. <laughs> One pump by the side of the road. Yeah. Once, once you get more south in Spain, it gets very boring. Yeah. Very boring. It's just flat. Well, it's the plain, isn't it? Yeah. And And it's just horizon to horizon. What we've done, staying up in the north, is much more interesting riding. Twenty-seven degrees, even though the signs in the street said thirty-two, but yeah. you wouldn't want it hotter than this. No. <laughs> not when you're just sitting here on a hot motorbike. Cool, not one bike has moved since whoever's at the front. Yeah. Oops. There's a drain there, Steve. Be ever so careful. My foot went right down in it. Oh, sorry. My Amigos card again. I should have taken it out, sorry. Because I always needed it when I had my passport. He has to scan them, you see, and wait. Thank you. Here we go, on the ferry again. Hey. Yippee! I'm always glad when it's not wet because when you go on that metal, on the metal road, oh, it's so worrying, isn't it, you think? It's bad enough riding on a metal road anyway. It's amazing how steep this is, isn't it? 
we got to do a sharp turn. Oh, where are we going? Group intercom disconnected. Oh, we got to turn around. If you want to get off, Heather, you get off quick. And then stand somewhere safe, okay? She wants me right across the other side now. 